See you. Oh, look, you just caught me right in the middle of something. I'm setting some traps. <laughs> oh, hello, everybody. Nice to see you. Uh, Jovis, what are you up to over there? Ah, well, the thing is, Sea Monkey, don't worry about that. Look, I'll tell you about that in a minute. Let's tell you guys about the show first. What are we going to be up to today, Monkey? What have we got planned? Oh, there's all kinds of great stuff happening today, Jovis. There's Arty Crafty Time, my favourite. Yeah. yeah, I know you like that. Yeah, and then there's uh, oh, Story Time, and then there's Scripture Time as well, yeah. And don't forget Song Time and Outside Adventure Time with the Creation Crew Kids. Yes, of course, of course, when you say it like that, I just don't know how we're going to fit it all in. <laughs> well, look, we'd better get a move on. I'll just need to finish setting up my traps first. Uh, dare I ask, why are you filling the house with traps? Oh, well, the thing is, Monkey, you see, I was watching on TV last night about the baddie baddie robbers, you see. No. And, I, and, and I got to thinking, I, I was ever so worried, what if the baddie baddie robbers got in here and took my awesome pad. Ah, oh, you can't waste your time worrying, Jovis. You lock the doors anyway, don't you? I do, Monkey, I do, yes, but I am worried. Worried, 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 Monkey. I need to be extra safe just to be... I mean, I mean, they could come in while I'm out shopping and take my favourite pants. <laughs> take your favourite pants? <laughs> You're getting traps set up so the baddie robbers don't steal your favourite pants. <laughs> well, is it not specifically my my pants monkey, but that's one thing that they could take, isn't it? I need to be safe. So, <laughs> have a look at this. Oh. What we've got here is a bucket full of sneezy powder, oh. so any robber who opens this door will get covered in sneezers. Up, up, up. Sneezy powder? Sneezy powder, that's right. Yes, they won't be able to take my pants if they've got a face full of sneezy dust, will they? Oh, I see, we're back to your pants then. Mm, well, not just that, Monkey. Next, we have this tripwire. Now, while the baddie is frantically trying to stop sneezing and dust the sneezy powder off his face, he'll fall over this tripwire here and he'll land face first into this huh? creamy trifle. Uh creamy trifle. Are you going to give him a cup of tea with that? No, 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 no. It's not for a cup of tea, monkey. You see, don't be ridiculous. Underneath the trifle is hidden a final oh. button. Oh. Which sets off the last piece of the trap. Oh, I see. Blinded by cream and jelly, the baddie robber won't see the big hammer springing up ah! to bonk him on the head and knock him out cold on the floor, Ooh. ready for the police to arrive. A big hammer set off by a trifle. <laughs> a very comprehensive plan, Jovis. That's right, Monkey. A big hammer set off by a trifle. I I'm just going to finish off here while you guys go and catch up on what the Creation Crew <laughs> kids are up to. Go on, why don't you go and see what they're up to? Uh, and I'll uh, carry on here. You go and have a look uh, through Yay! the window. Yay!
forget the wheels. Now we can rinse off all that dirty, soapy water. Oh, wasn't that lovely? That really is one of my favourite things, seeing what those Creation Crew kids get up to. Anyway, I'm just finishing off here. Mr Bo Santi Craco's coming round for a bit of tea and cake. Oh, that sounds nice. Mm, it should be. I I've had to be very careful, though. <laughs> In, in what way? Well, I was getting so worried. I was reading last night, you see, Monkey, uh, when I started looking at cake recipes, and apparently all that butter and sugar can be very bad for you. Well, only if you have a little too much. Yeah, well, still, I still started to worry, Monkey. I, I, I don't want Mr Bosanti Craco to get poorly teeth or a bad heart because of me. Ooh, well, no, but yeah, the thing is, That Jovi would be awful, so I devised my own recipe. Oh? Oh, yeah? Well, I was up all night worrying about making us all poorly, Monkey, and it was the only safe thing to do. What was, then? <laughs> what was? Well, to make a cake with no butter or sugar in it, of course. And there it is. <coughs> Wait a minute. Are you sure that's... Yeah, well, I... Uh, uh, oh, That'll be Mr Bo Santi Craco now. Right on time. Oh. Jovis, wait! The traps! The traps for the buddy robbers! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> oh, 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 Hervis, what on earth? Your house was rigged to attack you. What's going on? Did I get him? Did I get him? Did I, did I get the baddie robber? Uh, not unless the baddie robber is you, Jovis. Uh. Goodness me, Mr Bo Santi Craker, I'm so sorry for the mess. Come in, come in, do come in. Have a sit down. Oh, dear. I think, I think, have a seat there. Thing is, I've made a delicious cake. It's lovely jo treat. Jolly Just kind me. Oh, of you, I'm Mr. sorry. Bond oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, so oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Have a time. I've got it's, it's uh, uh, oh, it, a lovely treat, but just for you, just here. <clears throat> oh. Now, about that cake. Let's just ah. Oh. Mm. I'm so proud of this. Oh, I think you're going to love it, Mr. Bo Santi Craco. Mm. <sighs> Mm. Oh, uh, hmm. <laughs> Seems to be. I, I think the knife's a little bit blunt. I'll just get something a bit sharper. <laughs> yes, I'll be with you now. It's a proper cake knife. <laughs> Ooh, uh, oh, um, yeah, I'll be with you in a minute. It's just, it's just, it's just firmed a, formed a, a firm, a firm crust, I think. <laughs> <coughs> Right in a moment. Just one moment. Coming along now. <laughs> oh my goodness me. <laughs> Aha, I know. <laughs> it's delicious, I'm quite sure. <laughs> there we go then. There we are. Oh, this is doing it now. This has got it. <laughs> Ah, there it is. Oh, I'm sorry. I might have got a little bit of... <laughs> I don't want any sneezy dust on your cake, Mr. Bozanti Craco. Ah, there we go then. Mm. Ah, that's a nice bit of cake for you there. Um, thank you. Yeah, tuck in. <laughs> What have you done? This piece 
piece of cake? Oh, it's made of wood. Is it piece of cake or is it wood? Oh, wait, oh, oh, oh no! I was so worried you wouldn't like it. So worried, so worried! Of course I don't like it, man. It's, it's horrendous! What have you done? What on earth is it? It tastes like wood as well. It is possibly a little bit hard because I didn't use any sugar or butter. No, no sugar or butter. What kind of cake has no sugar and butter? Oh, I'm so sorry. I was so worried I'd make you poorly with all the sugar and the butter. I was up all night worrying about it. Perhaps you should have worried a little more whether your cake would break my tooth. Dear me, perhaps you could invite me back when you've learned to cook. Oh. I don't know. I'm a very good cook! I'm a va- Oh dear. Oh, I really messed up that one, didn't I? Oh, what's he gonna think of me now? He's gonna tell everybody. Funny, all that worrying and you were never worried about looking silly again. <laughs> <laughs> now, I have something else to worry about now, don't I? What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? <laughs> Mr. Bonhovis! But did you see that, Bucky? Did you see that? Those socks of mine were singing again right then. Did you see? Don't be ridiculous, Jovis. There are no such things as singing socks. Oh my goodness, I'm worried I'm going mad. Calm down, calm down. Why don't you take a little time out and have a story with the boys and girls? All this worrying isn't doing you any good. Yes, but what if they don't like it? That's something to worry about right there. Oh, it's a delightful little story, Jervis. I'm sure the children will love oh, it. Oh, good, good. Is, uh, is this it down yeah. here? Oh, yeah, I guess All right, I lovely. Thank Bye. you, Bookie Worm. Bye. Oh dear, I hope you do like it, everybody. Let's see, what is it today? Mm. Oh, Weezer's Amazing Adventure. Oh, that sounds pretty cool, doesn't it, eh, monkey? Yeah, yeah cool! Mm, I, I do like a good adventure. <laughs> Captain Weezer was organising an adventure. Mm. All the little bunnies in the Warren were invited and the excitement was building as the time drew near. Everybody knew all about Captain Weezer's adventures. Yeah. He was famous Ooh. for them. For years now, he'd been taking the little bunnies on all kinds of treats, like hikes in the mountains, oh. campouts oh. in the forest, yeah. oh, <laughs> fishing at Rapid River and snorkelling on Mudlark Beach. Yeah, that sounds like my kind of guy, Jovis. Wow, monkey, those are some of my favourite things. I'd sure like to go on an adventure with him. Mm. Anyway, bags were getting packed, teddies were being tucked mm. into pillowcases, and little faces were being kissed goodbye by their family and friends. Mm. Be good little bunnies, make sure you stay safe, and listen to everything Captain Weezer tells you. We will, bye! Everyone called out, so excited to be getting on the bus together and heading off on their adventures. Ooh. Soon enough, they arrived at the base camp, and there was Captain Weezer waiting for them. Uh, the first thing that they noticed was that he didn't look all that happy. Mm -hmm. He had a sort of a worried look mm -hmm. on his face. Mm. I wonder what's the matter with Captain Weezer, said all the little bunnies. Come inside, little ones. Come in out of the chill before you catch your cold. Oh, come on in, come on in. Ooh. So they all began to settle into the cosy cabin and pack their things away, choosing their beds and the best place by the fire. Mm. Everyone was yapping and chattering about all the fun they were going to be having. Yeah. Uh, soon enough, Captain Weezer went to the front to talk to everybody. Mm -hmm. Children, I've been terribly worried about this weekend. Oh. I've been giving it some thought mm. and, and I just think that there are too many things that oh. could go wrong. I've been terribly worried indeed oh. Oh. and I think we'd better not go snorkelling at Mudlark Beach this time. Oh no! No snorkelling? What a shame! Yeah, oh. yeah, monkey, yeah. 
The children were most upset, and as it turned out, Captain Weezer had been worrying about some other things too. And I must say, children, he said, it's a miracle we've survived this long, trekking in the mountains. So many things that can go wrong. What a worry, what a worry. All those wild animals. I'm afraid we'll have to give that a miss this year. Oh, Captain oh. Weezer, what will we be doing then? Yeah, what will they be doing? Oh, I was worried you'd ask me that, children. He was worried. Worried, did I? <laughs> I think it would put my mind at rest if we all just cosied up in here by the fire and waited until it was time to go home. Oh. That way, there'd be nothing to worry about. Oh, my. The children were so upset. What a disappointment. All their adventures ruined over some silly worries. Oh, I can't believe it! What a thing to happen! Mm. But there was a very clever child called Eli who could see the problem. And he sat down to talk with Captain Weezer. Captain, have you done everything you can to make everything safe? Of course I have, said Captain Weezer. Mm. Well, mm. Captain, if you've done everything you can, mm -hmm. you must trust God to do what you can't. Mm. What do you mean, said the captain. You see, captain, said Eli, when you worry, you're not trusting God. But when you trust oh. God, you have to believe he will look after you in the mm. ways you have mm. no control over. That's faith. Do you have faith? Of course I do. Well then, Captain, stop worrying. You've done your part. The rest is up to the Lord. Now, let's take these children on an adventure. <laughs> <laughs> of course, Eli, you're right, you're right. I wasn't trusting God at all. Well then, children, you've come for an adventure and that's just what we're going to have. Let's go. <laughs> and from Yay! that moment, Captain Weezer stopped worrying and put his trust in God, which meant everyone could have the fun that they'd come for. Oh. And a great time they had. <laughs> oh, brilliant, yeah. I thought the whole holiday was ruined. <laughs> oh, yeah. So did I, actually. Oh, dear, it didn't look good for a minute, did it? Oh, Mr. Oh. Van Hoses, can you come here for a moment, please? Hello, lovely little mousey. What can I do for you today? Would you like to pop inside for a chat and a nice cup of tea? Well, that sounds lovely. Mm. Ah, here we go, lovely. Now, Dora, you're, you're not going to tell me today that I'm somehow like a, an outdoor adventure holiday captain, are you? I mean, that's just silly. I, I hardly ever take children fishing. You and Captain Weezer had a lot in common, Jovis, but it's not the outdoor adventuring I'm talking about. Oh, well, what then? Worry, Jovis, worry. It's no good to anybody. Oh, really? Doesn't worrying help us help keep us safe? Not in the least little bit. It takes your trust away from God and makes you act all silly. I mean, wooden cake with no sugar or butter and all those silly traps all over the place. Yeah, gosh, it's quite true. I, I would have been better off if I hadn't worried about it at all. It's good to take care and be safe, but when you've done what you can do, the rest is up to God and he takes care of us. Mm, yeah, I see that, Dora. You're right. Yeah, worry, worrying is its just the same as not trusting God, isn't it? Not trusting God to look after us. <laughs> That's a silly idea, isn't it? <laughs> Someone should write a song about that, really. Hey! Wait a minute, I already did! <laughs> it's song time! <laughs> Safe, but when you've done what you can do, the rest is up to God and He takes care of you. If you trust and talk to God, He'll bless you every day and you'll have every confidence in every single way. Don't worry, trust God. Don't worry. 
trust God Don't worry Trust God Don't worry Just trust in the Lord Put your seatbelt on Don't jump out the window Use a bit of common sense But the rest is up to God Who stands in your defense You can't spend your life a worrying Nibbling your nails away The Lord gave you better things to do With this God-given day Don't worry Don't worry Trust God Trust God Don't worry no, Don't worry Trust God Trust God Don't worry Don't worry Trust God no, Trust God Don't worry Just trust in the Lord yeah, Trust in the Lord Stress, stress, just trust the Lord There's no good in the worry, 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 worry Just talk to God Cause if you share all your worries with Him You'll see He's there for you And if you really, really, really believe That's what you'll do And what do you think she said? Something like, if you worry a lot, you're just not trusting God to take care of you. No, no, she said, she said, if you worry a lot, you're just not trusting God to take care of you. <coughs> hey, clever clogs. <laughs> How do you know it's true, though? Uh, what do you mean? Well, I could tell you, fish nest in chimneys and birds live at the bottom of the sea. How can you be sure? Ah, I see what you mean. Check, Check if, if it's, it's in, in the, the Bible. Bible. It's scripture time. Get your, get your, get your, get your Bible out. Get it out, whip it out. Whip it, check, check scripture time. Hey. Ah. Hey, monkey baby. Hey. <laughs> Let's check it out then. Here we go. Fish. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Nests in trees oh. and birds oh. at the bottom of the sea. Oh. It's not in here. <laughs> not surprised. OK, then, what about not worrying and trusting God? Well, let's mm. see if I didn't just mark something up a little bit earlier. Oh, Ooh. what's the reference? Oh, it's Ooh. Matthew chapter mm -hmm. 6, starting from verse 25. Ooh. Ah, so I tell you, now this is Jesus speaking. Mm -hmm. So I tell you, don't worry about the things you need to live, mm. what you'll eat, what you'll drink, or what mm -hmm. you'll wear. Yeah. Life is more important than food. Yeah. The body's more mm -hmm. important than what you put on it. Mm -hmm. yeah, Look at yeah. the birds. They don't plant, yeah, yeah. harvest, yeah, yeah. or save food in barns, mm. but your heavenly Father feeds them. Yeah, that's yeah. great. Yeah. Don't you know you are worth so much more than they are? Mm. You cannot add any time to your life mm. by worrying about mm. it. <laughs> there you go. It's in the Bible. So you know you can bank on it. Absolutely right, monkey. If it's in God's word, it's safe all right. Don't worry. Trust God. Thing is, I've got a terrible memory. Yeah, me too, Richard. Me too. Terrible <gasps> memory. Uh, Richard? Jovis, my name's Stripey Monkey. <laughs> oh, sorry, I forgot. <laughs> Told you I had a terrible memory. <laughs> well, how are we going to remember not to worry then? And, and to trust God? Mm, well... Why don't we make something? Oh. Yeah, let's do a make to help us remember. Let's <gasps> <gasps> Now 
Now, Monkey, I know that this is one of your favourite things, but I've noticed that you do occasionally get it a little bit wrong, which is not setting a good example to the boys and girls. Oh, sorry. Yes, well, perhaps if you paid closer attention, you might be able to follow the craft a little bit better. Anyway, today we're going to make the most funnest bird glider in the world ever. Why a bird glider? Well, do you remember in scripture time, mm -hmm. Jesus was saying how much more important you are than the birds mm -hmm. and that God takes care of you. So we shouldn't worry. Mm -hmm. So that's why we're making a birdie glider. Okay, this is great. What you're going to need for this one is a drinking straw like this, preferably one that's got a bendy bit in the middle, but that's not really essential. Okay, some sticky tape, a pair of scissors, and some pens with your favourite colours. Also, you'll need one piece of stiff paper or card. Okay, now to start off, what we're going to do is fold this in half so that we can cut out a pair of wings which are exactly the same on each side. Okay, so you're going to want to draw a shape that's like one bird's wing. Do, 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 like that, and then with some feathery bits along the bottom, like so. Can you see that? And then for the back end of the glider, you need the bird's tail. So it's a very, very similar thing again. So you're going to do much like a, a smaller bird's wing, which is for the bird's tail, like this. Look. Do, 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 do. And then. Do, 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 do. OK. Nice and easy. If you can't do it yourself, just get an adult to help you. Now you want to cut these out carefully using the big scissors. Again, get an adult's help if you're not allowed to use scissors or if you think that you might. Chop your fingers, you don't want to do that. Okay, so just cut these out. Lickety spit, lickety split. And around here like so. There we are. How's yours getting on, monkey? Are you paying attention to what I'm telling everybody? This is a tricky one, isn't it? Not at all, Jovis, not at all. Today is the day when I get it right at last! <laughs> Fantastic, I'm ever so glad. Now, what you need to do now is getting that drinking straw, open out these birdies' wings. And you can decorate them any way you like, put some feathers on them or something like that. Now, what I want you to do is tape across there and across there to attach the tail and the front wings to this drinking straw. And when you've done that, it should look just like this. Can you see how I've taped across there and I've taped across there? And I've used a little bit of sticky tack, or you can use some modeling clay to weigh it down at the front. Look at that. Let's have a look at yours, monkey. Let's see how it's turned out. Ta-da! There you go, Jovis. My very own absurd glider. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> um, <laughs> ridiculous. Yeah, totally. Yeah. It's meant to be a bird glider. Oh. Is this is this oh. a pair of ears and a pair of noses? <laughs> An absurd glider. Oh, monkey, <laughs> weren't you listening? <laughs> ah! Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think mine's probably a bit more memorable anyway. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I've ever seen a glider made of ears and noses. <laughs> anyway, here's my bird glider. Let's see if we can make that fly. Watch this. Look. Oh, oh that flies really nicely. See how yours turn out at home. Well, that's it. That's mm. all we've got time for today, boys and girls. It's the end of the show. I hope you've had as much fun as we have. It's goodbye from me, Jovis Bonhovis, and these guys, the creation crew. Now, don't forget, Jesus loves you. Yeah. Bye! Bye! Bye.